Hello everyone, welcome back to Techie Pocket, and welcome back to the GX620 series. I know it's been a while since I've done this, but I haven't abandoned it. There's one more video to go after this one, so make sure you subscribe for that if you want to see that. Anyways, back to this episode. Today we're going to be talking about productivity, meaning like office programs, heavy duty, and mid-range. To test these, I'm going to be using WordPad, Calculator, Paint.net, and uh, Vegas Pro. Paint.net and Calculator will give us a good idea if this is good for office applications like Microsoft Office, OpenOffice, LibreOffice, and of course like surveillance and stuff, ATMs, whatever. Vegas and Paint.net will give us a good seeing if it is good for high-end like uh, video rendering, basic low-quality video rendering, and a little bit of photo editing. Okay, to begin, I started with WordPad. I was able to open about 10, maybe 18 uh, windows without glitching the computer, and everything inside WordPad worked fine. The only problem I'd say is if you want to open more than 10, I recommend you go to eBay and find some cheap upgrades to upgrade this thing from 1 gigabyte to 4 gigabytes, and then of course it'll be a $10 computer instead of a free one. Next I tested Calculator, and to nobody's surprise, of course it worked perfectly, I could open 100 of these without the computer glitching, but after I got to 200, the RAM just went too high and crashed the PC. Now moving on to the heavy duty and mid duty tasks, I tested Paint.net. Now of course this is going to take a little bit of power to run on. It actually booted up in about 5 to 10 seconds, and the only problem was it lagged behind my cursor about 10 to 20 milliseconds maybe. Besides that, everything worked fine, and if you just got a little too graphically intense, then of course it would crash the PC because there's not enough memory. But besides that, everything works. And, lastly, for Vegas Pro, it didn't even start giving me this message. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As you can see, this PC is good for stuff like surveillance, uh, light office op applications like uh, open office, stuff like that. Light, light um, photo editing, like maybe barely, not too much. And of course everything like Calculator and WordPad worked fine. Vegas didn't even start as this is a 32-bit processor. And besides that, there's nothing really you can do with this. Of course you can use it for emulators and stuff, but that's not this video. That's not this video. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you did not, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.